Hey guys, we are back here at the studio at the local live. I'm Kyote. And I'm Kate. Kyote, tell us what's hot besides you. Well, guys, listen, my wife knows how to make me blush, fellas. Let me tell you that right now. But today, Kate, we are bringing you Detroit, <laughs> directed by none other than Catherine Bigelow, who won an Oscar for The Hurt Locker, mm -hmm. making her the first female director to ever win that prestigious award. I know. And you know, she's just, she's one of my favorites, and she really deserved it for Absolutely. that film. But this is another great film. And in this film stars John Boyega from, uh, you may know him from Star, Star Wars, Wars. Will Poulter, really creepy, uh, Algie Smith, mm -hmm. and uh, co-starring two of our favorites, John Krasinski and Anthony Mackie. Just to name a few. This film chronicles the events that unfolded the night of July 25th, 1967 at the Algiers Hotel during the riots in Detroit, Michigan. Yeah, really powerful film, and you know Catherine Bigelow knows how to oh, yeah. spice up the intensity in her film. So oh, yeah. guys, let's take a quick look at this clip. Check it out. It's a war zone out there. They're destroying the city. I'm trying to help here. Don't say another word. Come on. told you what I saw. What is going on here? It's not that simple. I know exactly who you are. <laughs> Man. You know, I, I'm really creeped out by Will Poulter's eyebrows, though. That's like, what you I, got out of the clip. They're just, That's what... No, not only, but it's just I couldn't take my eyes off him. But anyway, this film does look it. great, and I can't wait <laughs> to see it. Fun fact, in case you guys didn't know, Catherine Bigelow was up against her ex-husband, James Cameron, Titanic. for Best Director in 2010. <laughs> her for The Hurt Locker and him for Avatar. Check out Detroit, opening this Friday, August 4th. Now, that's awesome and all, but let's get to some TV now, okay? Mm -hmm. So right now, we are in the second season of Insecure, which is on HBO. And we watched the first episode, yeah. and we, we liked it, all right? So this season's definitely shaping up to be a great season. This show depicts a clear character study into protagonists, um, common discovery of occurrences in her life as an African-American woman in L.A., and uh, it tells the story in a very satirical and intelligent way. Totally. You know, I wasn't a huge fan of this show last season. Mm. I stuck I with it. it just out of loyalty. Yeah. Uh, it definitely needs to be fine-tuned a bit more in terms of the acting, especially our main protagonist, Issa, played by producer, actor, and writer Ooh, Issa Rae. Jack of all trades. Indeed, Jill. <clears throat> uh, you have a gem on your hands. It definitely has great potential, and I'm sticking with it. Well, guys, thank you for tuning in. Stay tuned for another edition of Scriptly Live right here at the Local Live. Take care, guys. Later. Bye.